I had loved the Kansas City Police Department, but I didn't believe it was salvageable. If you've heard calls recently to defund the police,
Okay, so new record store today that I'd never been to in St. Clair Shores, Michigan, Wax and Tracks. Had a very good selection. I was really uh, knocked out by the amount of record store day uh, items that they still had. They had a crap load of record store merchandise. I was talking to the owner and he was telling me that they overstock, they over order just to make sure that they have everything that everybody wants. And they even had leftover record store day merchandise from the June record store day. However, I inquired about the police live sets and he said, no, sorry, those are the only two uh, pretty much that they don't have, uh, which I understand they're pretty hard to come by. But uh, nonetheless, I will show you what I picked up at this fabulous new store that I checked out. Um, got a couple of Depeche Mode records to uh, expand my collection. This is Exciter. This was from 2007. Cover is very reminiscent of The Violator. Some of the music is also reminiscent of Violator, a little more electronic, a little less harsh than the previous album, Ultra, which I also picked up. This was from 1997. Uh, this is a reissue. This is not, I don't know if this was originally pressed on vinyl uh, or not. But happy to have those two as part of the collection. This is a two record set. This is a one record set. And I grabbed this because we have a whole bunch of these. Uh, and I'm a huge CSNY fan. Listen to a little bit of this and it sounds amazing. Uh, some of it um, is the teacher children sounds like it's an acoustic demo. Uh, but carry on. Uh, definitely sounds great. I noticed there's not the organ at the end and the guitar solo lead guitar is different at the end and almost cut my hair is a really long extended version with different guitar. Um, that's as far as I got listening to this record, but very happy to grab it. Ironically enough, I don't have the original. I've never been able to find a clean copy of that. So got that one and someday I will hunt down the uh, original Deja Vu. I uh, got this for my REM collection. This is their EP, Chronic Town, the very first release from REM. Had been wanting this one. This is a repress. Um, I don't remember the year, 2010, something like that, but I don't care. It's in great condition. Got it for a steal. And uh, now I got pretty much most REM on vinyl. Some of their later stuff I don't have, but very happy to have that one. Um, and this is a cassette that I picked up for only a dollar. Uh, I like the police. I like sting. So happy to grab 10 summoners tail on cassette. And then this, I did not pick up at the store, but it is my birthday today. So I got this in the mail. This was a gift from my uncle. This is Jimi Hendrix. This is the repress of electric lady. Lee. Electric Lady Land. Uh, and I know this is going to sound amazing. Uh, the Essential Hendrix vinyl collection that I had sounded absolutely pristine. So good on vinyl. So I can't wait to throw this on the turntable and hear what this sounds like. Um, and my mom got me a shirt, which. I will show it to you also, because I'm a Beatles fan, if you didn't know. Uh, but anyway, that's what I picked up today. Um, hope you like the crate digging uh, footage that I was able to find. I will definitely be heading back there. Hope you're having a great Monday. Take care.